It started with a conversation in Monaco this year. At some point, one of his agents, Eduardo, came to watch the practice next to me. At some point, Edo said something like, oh, Julie, you must have all of Novak's attire. And I said, actually, I only have two hats and a wristband. And he said, oh, you don't have a racket. I said, that's the one I would love to have. And he said, why don't you ask him? I said, no, 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 I don't ask. He said, I'll ask him for you. I remember Edo being like, you need to make Novak aware about this. So I did at Wimbledon. And Novak was like, really? I said, no, I, I don't have one. He was like, at the end of this tournament, you're having one. I'm promising that. I said, okay. okay. Usually we wait by a balcony where the winner does interviews and suddenly Novak saw me and he was like, 30 seconds after that, Edo comes back on the balcony. We walked down 10 meters. Then I went and Edo threw it to me. He held his promise. I respect him for that. And then I pretended I slept with it. Lay back. Which I did not. <laughs>